Hey, my name is Patsy Brown. Um, the reason why I'm coming to you with this video today is to let you know that mental illness is real. Um, on last Wednesday, um, just back it up a little bit. Um, I was married for six years. My husband died on me and everything um, November the 8th, 2013. After he died, um, five months later, I think five or six months later, um, on April the 3rd, 2014, I was diagnosed with um, stage 3 uterine and ovarian cancer. I have been going through depression and everything. Like I said, mental illness is very real. But fast forwarding to last Wednesday, this past Wednesday, I was doing a fast and prayer and I was asking God to pray for my relationship with you, number one thing, and my finances. That's the main reason why I wanted to fast. And I was thinking and praising God that I moved in the house, moved into a better place. I used to stay in College Bill Projects and everything like that. But I thank and praise God for his goodness and his mercy. He didn't have to do anything for me. But recently, like this past week, um... If you don't know, I had a hard childhood. Some people have a hard childhood. I was molested at 13 years old and raped, gang raped. As a kid. And I didn't love myself. And all the thoughts on this past Wednesday when I was fasting, I wanted to kill myself. And I know that's not from God. I know that was from the devil. And plus, I'm a war reward. And Bishop preached this, this Sunday. I'm recording on the Sunday about don't worry about the cares of this life or don't worry about nothing. I am a servant. I'm a first Sunday greeter. But also... He wanted me to pray the word of God, especially the Psalms, especially other scriptures on each area of my life that I'm going through. Um, my thoughts were to kill myself. Like I said, I wanted to um, die because my husband was dead. But by the grace of God, I read the scriptures and I felt so, and I told Bishop Lowe, I felt so much better. I felt much better. Um, but I'm still dealing with depression. I talked to this um, depression and anxiety group and everything like that. And they've been helping me with everything. I'm back on depression medications. I was off of it for a minute um, I'm thanking and praising God that he has um, made a way for me he has made a way for me I'm still dealing with some issues I had to push some people out of my life I didn't have a relationship with my mother she didn't want nothing to do with me but I'm thanking and praising God I said Lord help me every day I'm not where I supposed to be and he's still helping me through the situation and I want to say hold on to God's unchanging hand never give up he will never leave you or forsake you 